Jack Henry lifts it back inside of Warrior territory. Brennan Nelson takes the puck on a hop. He's down the right side. Nelson's got a man in front. Sharoon tipped just wide. Because getting back to make that play was Bauer Morris. who deflected that puck away from the front of the goal. Now Cranbrook turns it back. Jack Silich right side drop pass. Shot. Smith stopped by Hamming. And he'll hang on and get a face off back inside of his own zone. Back and forth the chances go as the game remains 0-0. In the opening minute of the second period, great look for Brennan Nelson down the right side. A centering pass with Riley Sharoon going to the goal, but a Bucks defender got in the way that I think it was Morrissey. No, sorry, it was Jack Henry who got his stick on the puck and poked it away. And then following up on that, Jared Smith took a drop pass in the high slot. His shot stopped by Caden Hamming keeps the game 0-0. Hillich up the right side. Jaden Moriello trying to work this puck out, and the Warriors do push it out through center, courtesy of the long reach of Devlin, but here comes Cranbrook the other way. Feuder drops it off right side. Donovan free is back in front. They score. The centering pass from Frias finds Blake Cotton going to the front of the goal, and he tips it home past the blocker side of Caden Hamming. Cotton's got his third of the year, and Cranbrook opens the scoring first. They lead at 1-0. Cotton going to the goal, got the inside edge. On. Hope you can join us for... We'll be on AM 1150 tomorrow, back on the radio airwaves tomorrow night, also here on bchltv.ca if you want to tune in and catch the action from Sam and Arm. Back down below the goal line, a centering pass in front, comes loose right side as it's Reese Bentham trying to lay it back down low and puck will come along left wing. Jackson Kungle to the blue line, or that was Cameron Kungle to the blue line. Puck loose right side. Oh, what a stop by Hamming. He made a fantastic save on the glove side, robbing Luke Foe in tight and keeps the game 1-0. Puck was sent to the front of the goal from Kungle on the left side. Kellen Charterson fed it to the right wing, and right in front of the goal was Luke Foe with a great opportunity, and Caden Hamming, so off the draw, it is Cranbrook that will possess. Bentham left point to the left side. Now a shot by Silich, and he drilled the one-timer wide. Here's Peluso back to the blue line. Bentham left side. Peluso with it again. A shot scores. <laughs> Tipped in front by Cam Kungle. The defenseman gets the deflection in front on the shot by Silich from the left side. And Cranbrook's opened up a 2-0 lead on the power play goal. So the goal for Kungle. The puck actually hit him in a pretty awkward spot. It's sent to the front of the goal by Henry. Knocked down by Hamming. Loose puck behind the net. Noah Quinn tried to feed it back in front. Michael Salandra will take it away for the Warriors. McDonald to the middle. Attempting to find Karan on that attempt. Got it back again in neutral ice. Guided it back ahead on the right side. Now it's Foe who will recover. Up the middle of the ice. Here's Donovan Frias. Gets around. Lafron. Blah! In with a shot. Good stop by Caden Hamming to keep the game 2-0. Here's Norland at the midpoint. Starting on this power play. Right side, Salandra. Salandra down below the goal line. Can't find the handle on that. Comes along to the left side. Now it's McDonald that will control. Ben McDonald left wing side. Back at the blue line. Now it's Norlin. Right side, Salandra. Dragging, shooting, scores! Michael Salandra took the shot from the right side and it finds its way through traffic past Nathan Airy on the blocker side. 21 seconds into the power play. Salandra's got the marker is 11th of the year, and the Warriors are within a goal. It's two to one. Nice screen in front by Luke Devlin, taking the eyes away from Nathan Airy and a toe drag shot by Michael Salandra. As the Warriors looking to try and 
come from behind here in the third. Down by a pair, they've cut the deficit to one. Off the end boards in front scores. Wow, you talk about an unlucky, unfortunate break. And that's exactly what happened against the Warriors. The Bucks get an unbelievable bounce off the end boards on a shot from the blue line by Bauer Morris. He came right to the front of the net and Donovan Frias puts it past the glove side of Caden Hamming and the Bucks lead 3-1. I don't know how you can get much more of a lucky bounce than that for Cranbrook.